guys welcome back and as you can see the title so let's just get straight into it and um this is how you do it i'm not gonna edit this video because i want you guys to see all the step that i'm doing and hopefully it worked for you i know it definitely worked for me and let's get into it all right so as you can see this pop up on your screen and you want to know how to fix it. So let me get you some signal. This is how you do it. What I did was um, I went over to settings, went over to settings, then I went on general and TV display. Then this is what you want to change. This right here is a problem. Once you change this, you will get signal right here. So I'm going to change it right now. Hold up. I'm going to change it. Recording and stuff like that. Um, I put it on 120 because I play better on 120 than 60. And this is how you do it. Um... You guys might not see well down here well, but this card right here uh, is coming straight from my TV. So you guys, if you guys have an Elgato, you guys already know how it work. This is my Elgato right here. So this is coming from the TV. I'm gonna plug this in, and then give me a second. And then I'm gonna plug the other side in. This is how I do my setup. I'm com currently working on my um, game room. When I move, I'm gonna have my own setup, my own section. And as you can see, I get I get signal. Yeah, as you can see, I get signal. See? Right now, I'm on... Um, right now, I'm on um, 60 hertz instead of um, 120. That's the problem, guys. As long as you want 60, the Elgato, you will have signal on the Elgato. So try that out and let me know if it worked for you. And let me know what you what you was doing wrong. And um, hopefully do help. I know it helped me. It took me a while to um, get it situated out, sorted out and everything. So yeah, peace.